You know, ever since the digital TV switch, I really haven't been watching all that much television. For the most part, I haven't even missed it. I have Netflix, Hulu, Torrance, and of course YouTube. But one thing I do miss is the amazingly campy infomercials you see between station breaks and after hours. Everybody knows these things, and everybody understands that they are rife with material to parody and make fun of. I know I'm not being original or creative or anything by doing this, and for the most part, the products they're advertising actually do fulfill a need that a good number of people may have. But once in a while, you come across a commercial for something so incredibly stupid that the only logical course of action is to ridicule the damn thing out of existence. So that's what I'm going to do today. This is Commercial Failure. the old commercial failure hat and see what our first victim is. Bottle tops. The fuck's a bottle top? The ingenious new way that turns your can into a bottle with the snap of a cap. Oh. Okay. Okay, well let's let's just start the commercial and see how far I go before I find something stupid. It's impossible to close an open can. Wait! He hasn't even fully faded in yet already. Who the fuck is that stupid? Who the hell tries to close a can? Open cans spill in the fridge. What a mess. Well, how about you don't put it in the fucking door? It fits virtually every brand of can, from mini cans to supersize. I'm sure all my friends will be really impressed when I break out the bottle tops at my next Super Bowl party. I'm sure that's a really great vote of confidence. Hey, thanks for coming to my party. These chips and dip on the table. The stripper should be here at about 6. And, uh, would you mind drink from this? Outdoors, bugs can crawl into your drink. Gross! Don't put your soda on the ground. Next! Look, open metal cans can't travel. What a waste! Bottle Top turns your can into a bottle that's perfectly portable. Yeah, because everybody knows you can't put a can in a cup holder. Oh wait, you just fucking did! Kids are always spilling their drinks, but Bottle Top keeps drinks from spilling over. Stop hanging it up and pick up the fucking can! Oh no! It fell on the floor! It's going all over! It's gonna seep into the carpet! What am I gonna do now? Oh, if only I'd used a bottle top, this never would have happened! Oh, we are gonna have ants! I also love how the little girl here appears to be drinking brisk. I remember when I was five years old, I couldn't get enough iced tea. And open cans lose their fizz. What a waste. My favorite part of this commercial is the way the announcer talks about sodas losing their carbonation. You'd think they have a lifespan shorter than a live-action Fox sitcom. Look, leftover sodas go flat. You just poured the entire can into the glass. I don't think that counts as leftover. I think it counts as some asshole opening a soda and forgetting about it for a week. The only time that ever happened to me was when I started playing Fallout 3. Now, I know I'm kind of a big guy, but is it really that hard for other people to finish a fucking soda? They're like 12 ounces, it's half the size of a big gulp at 7-Eleven. I also love how he says the soda will keep its carbonation for days. It keeps its carbonation for days. How many glasses do you think you're going to get out of that single can? Are you drinking from one of those paper pill cups? Bottle top comes in a this shot is really stupid because they're trying to demonstrate that you can tell which can is yours by showing the cap on different cans. Now, I know it's hard to tell the difference between crap and shit, but if you're so stupid that you can't remember whether you're drinking Monster or Heineken, GET HELP! This shot also managed to get in their product placement quota, which they obviously needed because they clearly couldn't rely on the product orders alone to pay for advertising costs. I suppose that's good budgeting because they don't know anybody who would buy this crap! If having flat soda is the biggest of your problems, consider yourself lucky! If you can afford to throw away soda just because it's gone a little flat, I think you're pretty fucking well off. And if you're really so worried, just buy it in a fucking bottle to begin with. And if your kid spills the soda, just make him clean it up himself. Teach that little snot some discipline. I swear he'll be more careful next time. Besides, I know it's not true or anything, but with all the stigma surrounding sugary drinks and hyperactivity, why are you letting your kid drink soda anyway? The only people who might buy this are people who buy soda in cans by the bulk because it's cheaper by the ounce. 
but anybody who drinks that much soda is not going to have any problem finishing a full can. And I can guarantee you that anybody who bought this in a drunken stupor while watching late night TV is going to have a bunch of useless bottle tops just sitting in a kitchen drawer somewhere collecting dust. This is just a stupid product marketed towards stupid people. And this is TZ, putting products in their place for you. If you have a commercial failure you'd like to see, visit Dragon Slayer Productions at testzeroesblog.blogspot.com, youtube.com slash dragonslayerpod, or send a message to dragonslayergames at gmail.com. Commercial failure is produced and hosted by Doug Hancock, all work copyright their respective owners and protected under fair use. Call now!